The Hornet's main purpose is to perform strike missions. To carry out these missions, the aircraft can carry a very large and diverse collection of ordnance. General purpose and laser-guided iron bombs, AGM-62 walleye glide bombs, AGM-65E Mavericks, CBU-59B Rockeye cluster bombs, BLU-107B Durandal anti-runway bombs, HARM high-speed anti-radiation missiles, and even the B-57 tactical thermonuclear device are all part of the Hornet's inventory for air-to-ground missions. To deliver this collection of ordnance, you'll be learning tactics and techniques for strafing, bombing, and the standoff employment of the walleye, maverick, and harm. Your technique will develop as you fly more missions. Take into account the construction of the characteristics of the target and the surrounding enemy defenses as you choose your method for attack. New HUD symbology is introduced in the topics to follow. Two of the new symbols are the pull-up Q and breakaway X. If any air-to-ground bombs or missiles are selected, the pull-up cue is displayed on the HUD. The distance between the pull-up cue and the velocity vector is your indicator for ground avoidance. If the two symbols intersect, the breakaway X is displayed on the HUD. At this point, immediately initiate at least a 4G pull-up and hold through to pull out to avoid the terrain. The ground comes up fast sometimes, so keep your head in the game. Complete the following sections and you'll have the knowledge to properly employ weapons from the Hornet in almost all situations. The key then will be practice, enabling you to execute the tactic and destroy the target.